Now we introduce Angelica. Over at the church, her egg was found by nuns. It was. It landed on. It landed carefully on the doorstep. It didn't crash. It just upon it, it, upon near impact, it stopped. And then it landed softly. And the nuns found their egg on the doorstep. And I, Sister, our Lord has blessed us with a young one from above. Yes, let's bring it in and offer our prayers upon to its health. And then a little while later, Angelica Rosie hatches. They save the eggshell for memories. So then they teach Rosie. Uh, they teach Angelica how to read the how to read with the Bible. And then they and then they let her out, and then she starts learning to fly. And then I keep trying, my child. The Lord has blessed you with wings, so one day you will fly to angelic heights. And then a little, and then like a little, and then a little while later, and then one night, a month later, or so she evol- she uh, she was sleeping, and then suddenly with the Lord's uh, Lord blessing, she evolves into, an- into Angelica Rose Chew. And then I just snuck in, and then I just, you know, as a director, I had to leave her her hairband and her slippers, because she was going to need those. Anyway, the next morning, uh, Angelica inter- intercepts the uh, nuns, and they're like, and she's like, blah, 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 and, then, and I just awoke anew. Well, Angelica, I knew the Lord would have a grand plan for you. Yes, he gave you a great script to follow. <laughs> Wee, I'm flying high. I believe I can fly. I'm Angelica, humble servant to our Lord. Every faith over time will reward you very well. So keep your head held up high, and one day you shall be blessed with good health, true love, and pure happiness. Spread your wings of hope and fly. Yay. And now, it's Ochi. So anyway, the uh, anyway his egg lands by the front, lands cautiously at the front door at the Nabi at Nabi's dojo shin. And then the uh, and then the egg was found by Shinabe, the uh, owner of the gym, and he just held it. He just kept it by his side, even while he was during t- teaching his classes. Let's let my young students. You make this master G D W proud. Now. We will perfect our chopper technique. You'll never know, and you'll need to cut a move. So let's get like this, and... Nani? Master Shinabi-san, your egg is shaken. So then, Punchy, jump, Punchy Sani jumps out of the egg, and then, and then lands in the... lands right in front of Master Shinabi. And then he, then he shows his fists and knuckles, and then he looks back, and he's like, Sorry, yay! And then he's like, "Great, it's a poemi saga." <laughs> and then uh, I don't know where one of the replies. I'll accept your challenge. It was Miss Maipo, and she took on the body posture and positions and gestures of the little Sonny as a challenge. Because my, because I, Maipo, call myself Bayashiko, will not allow a grasshopper like you to hatch into my director's dojo shin so easily. And then, and he, and, and then Shinabi says, Maipo, I'm only your father in this setup. Stay in character. And then I have to comment and say, yeah, and I'm the director of this anime, not Shinabe. And then she, and then she's just like, and then, so, she just reaches behind for the poor unexpected Sani. And she's like, and my opponent does not need this weak point. Yeah! Just rips the tail right off. And then right at that moment, he evolves. The punchy side shoe. And he's like, eh, that really hurt. And sends her flying sky high with a sky uppercut. And then Shinabe is surprised. He's like, wow, you are strong. I know what my fault did was wrong, but if you will let me. I can teach you how to center that power into a much better, less painful fighting style. And then Punchy's like, "Yeah, I'm Punchy. I'm Punchy, Strike Ninja. I studied under the GDW Shinabe, and I became the greatest fighter since Goku. I also learned to keep my temper down by watching TV comedies. <laughs> ah, they're so funny. I like the samurai pizza cats. Na 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 na." And then lastly, Magic Chan signs you. His egg landed in a mysterious mountain. He was like so lonely. He's like, he's ready to hatch anyway. I was like, hmm, it's cramped in here. So then he opens up his egg, lets out, and he realizes there's nobody around him. What the hey? But he's not as lonely as he thinks. 
you are not alone. Wow, where am I? What? Am I alone? No, you are not. Who are you? Where are you? What is this place? He's thinking all this. It being telepathic. I will be your mentor while you grow. I am telepathing with you from the Grand, from the Grand City. You are in a cave northwest of here where I temporarily resided. What do you want? I've noticed you had psychic abilities like me. I only wish to teach you how to use your powers properly. And when I have finished teaching you, you will go out into the world and seek out your own destiny. And so, event and so, during and so for a few months, uh, eventually during the first month, he does evolve from Magic Chance Sonny to Magic Chance Sanchi while levitating. The mysterious mentor taught this taught this Sonny how to hone his powers, lift objects mentally and physically, and what and what the outside world was like. The mentor also showed the young one images of popular movies, some featuring par parties for a treat. At the moment, parks at the monuments, parks, and other grand locations from around the world. Yeah, but he was my he evolved on it, and then he lied on that little fart. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> yeah, but then, then sometime later, Magic Chan sought you. I have taught you everything I have to teach you for now. For now. You, are, you are, you as well as your powers have grown marvelously. Master, will I ever meet you face to face? We will meet in the future, but now go out into the world and seek your own destiny. And then he teleports himself to the top of the mountain. Thank you, Master. I will not fail. I predict success in my future, for I see other hedgehog Pokemon and great adventures. My destiny is just to teleport away. Stay tuned for when these hedgehogs meet.